Hey guys, my name is Kiga and I am going to teach you guys how to install your PS3 controller for your Windows 10 device. Um, it might work on Windows 8, Windows 8.1 and Windows 7 and there is still a possibility that it will also work on Windows XP and Vista. So let's get started. First, uh, we, um, uh, we need these two softwares, the SCP thing and the xbox 360 controller driver i will just leave a link to the description below and yeah let's start now first um don't connect your ps3 controller to your pc no don't ever do that uh, i mean don't do that for now so um we're going to right click on this thing on the xbox 360 installer and run as admin and a accept next and you were just going to wait for that to install once that finish um, we're going to click on finish and this um, this time uh, we are going to insert our pre uh, ps3 controller to the PC so um, going to insert that thing you will hear that beeping sound and yet yeah, there will be no thing but you can see um it it is installing right here and once that finished um i want you to go to file manager um click on this pc um, double click on your OSC drive and right click and we are going to create a new folder and we're going to type in scarlet dot crush productions productions with an S there we go um, is that right yep scarlet crush productions okay once that finish uh, we're going to double click on this folder and we're going to return to our desktop oops wrong okay um, double click on the scp ds3 file um, um you will see a SCP server folder right here. Double click on that. Um, we're going to select both of these folders, the bin and source. Um, click and drag it to the Scarlet Crush Productions folder. And once that it's been extracted, um, again, when you look at your PS3 con controller, there is no light. Um, well, for me, there is no light. Um, there might be blinking lights on your part but that's fine um, double click on bin and we're going to right click on scp driver and run as admin now um, we're going to check these three things and install and there will be three um, things that will be installed the bus device bus driver and the ds3 usb driver i'm going to click on exit and right click and install that again yeah we're just going to install it three times and now there are two things that will be installed the bus driver and ds3 um usb driver exit and again we're going to right click on this run as admin and yeah install exit and this time we're just going to click on that double click force install install and um, once that finish um, as you can see there is still no light I'm um, going to close this and we're going to restart our PC
Hey guys, I'm Skiga, and once you restarted your PC, um, we're going to open File Manager, and uh, this PC. Okay. By the way, make sure that your PS3 controller is still connected to the to your computer. So open um, C drive again. We're going to Scarlet Crush Productions, bin. And we're just going to double click on SCP driver this time. And yeah, we're just going to leave it like that. Um, check configure service, um, Bluetooth service, um, Bluetooth driver, and uncheck force install. And we're going to click on install. And after that, your PS3 is now working. Um, if there is only one light in the number one thing, yeah, it is now working um if you don't see any light um you can just always disconnect your controller and yeah it will start blinking like that that's fine and wait for it to you know to stop the blinking thing Okay, uh, once it's stopped, as you can see, uh, we're going to insert, connect our PS3 controller to the PC again. You will hear a blinking sound and this thing will appear. So yeah, um, it will blink and it will return to the normal red, normal light not blinking thingy. And yeah, it is now working. And since um, the PC doesn't support it, doesn't support the PS3 controller, um, you will encounter a lot of problems with this. Um, this is actually my, I guess my 20th time installing this controller because I've encountered a lot of problems. Now I've used DS um my my first method was using D3S DS3 yeah and I was having a hard time um you uh, making this thing work properly and this method is the most um so far the most effective method so um if your controller won't work um someday uninstall everything um, so uninstall the Xbox 360 drivers first then uninstall this thing um, by double clicking on the SCP driver and clicking in uninstall and also delete this folder Scarlet Crush Productions and also go to device manager I'm um, going to device manager and look for devices and click on view devices and printers and we're going just to wait for it to load only do this when your PS3 controller stopped working because someday it will stop I promise because yeah it's been happening a lot to me the same thing with other users but um, so far it will work flawlessly and I'm just going to show you a demo of me playing a game that I love very much so as you can see um, there will be t um, two things so just yeah <laughs> um, to uninstall the, the driver the PS3 driver I click properties and click on hardware properties go to driver I mean general change setting driver and un uninstall only do this uh, when yeah and after that restart your PC and do the same method again and I hope it will work this time because um, the installation thing will not work 100% and 
and you just need luck and also it depends on the system so uh, we're we're going to demo our controller right now I am going to open um, not this the PPSS PP emulator and we're going to run uh, Metal Gear Solid Peace Walker there it is and I hope it's working yep it's working I can fast forward the game there we go so um, I changed my controller settings for this game as you can see um, this is the control mapping I changed everything and you all see Xbox 360 because you know the driver that we just installed is emulating the Xbox 360 controller so um, since we're using a PS2 controller it's um, the driver is telling our PC that we are using a an Xbox 360 controller so yeah it's fooling the PC something like that and yeah let's try this hmm. um, yeah let's change the settings I think there's a lot of changes happened yeah deep pad um, circle X Oh, press start. Okay. That's why it wasn't working. I press start. And as you can see, it works very fine. So, yeah, that's how you install a um a ps3 controller for the pc now i know this tutorial is long um, i just wanted to make it very clear as possible at the same time i sh i've shown you guys how to in uninstall the drivers once there was uh, once there will be a problem with your ps3 controller so again that's it um thanks for watching please leave a like comment and subscribe to the giga channel for more tutorials and you can you guys can request a tutorial and I will make one and yeah I just wanted to say that Metal Gear Solid 5 is a Hideo Kojima game <laughs> okay guys thanks for watching bye